So the day has come. I'm being induced. It's uh, March 10th, and we're getting ready to see both my babies, Kai and Sai. I'm nervous and excited and all that stuff. I got it, Mommy. Um, so we're praying. So we're checked into our hospital room. It's spacious. Husband notifying some folks what's happening. Um, it's 6 30. Um, they haven't started me on any inducing medicine yet, but they will. And um, we were supposed to have been here at 6, but there was a lot of traffic. So here we go. Not sure how much vlogging I'll do from here on, but I told y'all I would attempt. Here's my attempt. <laughs> All right. So we're getting the I V. No, what is this called? That's uh, the I V. Well, well, where y'all called it before? It was something else. A half, a half. Oh, a half block. Half block. Getting the half block put in. We got good veins. We got those veins, and if I did drugs, it would go straight to my brain. I'd be <laughs> high within a second. <laughs> But today we're just putting this in to give me IV fluid That's right. and eventually a tough set. Lovely, lovely mom has made it to the uh, labor and delivery. How are you feeling? Excellent and excited. You excited? Yes. <laughs> she looks so cute. She got so, she got so dressed up for the babies. Absolutely. Oh, and uh, my mother is going to be the videographer this time, and she's yes. going to do it. Yes, I am. <laughs> she's putting on for y'all. She's putting on for y'all. That's why I love her. Because yes. I'm Angel's mother. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm um, three centimeters, um, 80% of face, and they have started me on the Pitocin. So... I'm able to take these contractions right now with the Pitocin. Feel good eating water chips. Hopefully they won't break my water anytime soon and they'll just let it stay intact. Because that's when it's going to get real. Haven't had epidural yet. I'm just going to wait that out as long as possible. All right. Fingers crossed. I think my water just broke. Well, my doctor tried to rupture it. And I think it finally actually broke, broke. So my husband has put on gloves to, to check. Is it? <laughs> you looking for the bright light? It's a back behind. Look, look, see if it's that. No, that's all. It's probably one of them big things. You see them looking for the lights. They're trying to be official. And look down at my hoo ha. Main power. I'm clicking a light switch I, here. I you clicking it down, maybe. I it down. Look, there's two switches. This one's up, the top one's up, right? Yeah, try that. Not working. This is hilarious. Use the light from your phone. I Thanks, he's an OBGYN. <laughs> check for fluid. It, like I'm a car. Yeah. I think we might have something going on. The boy come out. I don't know. No, no. Come to see if it's if you water broke. Well, he went to to break it. Okay. I just feel like I felt I felt oh, wow. some stuff come down. <laughs> He's a fool. <laughs> feeling good. This is God's blessing right here. I'm feeling good. So my water definitely broke. We found the light switch. Marcus checked. There's clear water. <coughs> <coughs> However, Marcus, the uh, dad doctor, is let him get his sleep in so he can be awake and ready to get these babies. Amazing grace. Um, 
Yes, for a moment. Oh. Meanwhile, I'm uh, just being an assistance when I can and where I can. I got a short nap in on that little guy, believe it or not. Um, yeah, delivery is hard. I barely got a nap. back um, as you can see we're going to the operating room they actually had it in my size I'm like six five um, so we're going into the operating room a standard procedure when you're having twins apparently um, in case so when the first one comes out in case they got to go up in and change their procedure or change their plans or anything and go grab the second one anyway um, so yeah so Angel's in there they're putting around the bed and I'm about to go in get some of this on film um, kind of digging these scrubs yeah I'm digging those anyway um, keep you posted yeah still waiting um, I can hear them in there talking they're getting geared up and ready to go getting a little nervous I've been pretty cool the whole entire nine months um, just a little bit of nervousness setting in not a whole lot all I can do is react not a lot we can do there um, yeah let's do this twins do you want me to try my hand? It's upside down. It doesn't matter. I can flip it. Do you want to put it in there? Here we are. There he is. There he is. There he is. Both legs out. So Marcus is here. The babies are waiting on him. This is the lovely Miss Emily. She's taking care of us. She was supposed to be coming to do pictures, but she's actually turned into one of the, like the head nurse on the floor, so. I'll take it. <laughs> We're going to get Marcus. You here to see, you here to see your brothers? <laughs> Come around. Don't Come around on the other side. Mama's okay. They just had to make sure everything was good after the babies got here. You want to take off your shoes? Slip off your shoes. Mm -hmm. Be careful. Oh. Come on. So. Hi. Come on. So. Hi. This is going to be your best friend. This is going to be your best friend. Just like this. But he's a lot smaller than you were. Look at how tiny he is. Isn't he tiny? Then I'm trying to make sure you ate it in these ways. I know I'm getting out of it. There we go. And then he's over here. He's, he's a big old baby. So who's who? Tell me the name. It's so much one side. Yes. He's got dimples like you. Yeah, yeah, you're their big brother. Are you excited about them? Yeah, well, you know what, when, they, when you first come out of the womb, there's a lot of stuff for you. So he's got a lot of like crusty skin that will get off of him. <laughs> so he'll look pretty. It's my son, point out all the imperfections. He's like, uh, what's wrong with it? Why does he smell like that? Why does it look like that? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody. Uh, he got wet a bit. You hear Miss Emily? He's so excited, can't believe it. He's he a little foot. foot. He's oh, my little foot. Oh, oh, oh my god. But that'll eventually come off and it won't hurt him. Oh. They stuck him with a needle. He cried a little bit. Oh my god. Mark is looking at it like this. Why does it look like it? Yeah, that's gonna fill in. Yeah, you will wrinkle <laughs> like this. 
You are a little wrinkled, baby. And now let's look at his feet. See what his feet look like. You can touch it with feet. Look at his feet. Oh, look at him. He's getting upset. Mad. See him getting mad? Because he's getting cold. It was warm under there. You can touch him. Touch him. Touch him. Touch him. Did you expect him to look like this? <laughs> oh, he got me. All right, so I didn't do much vlogging at the hospital because I was extremely exhausted. Um, and as most of you already know, uh, dealing with mixed emotions about changes happening in my family. But I can still say I'm very blessed to have both of my little babies. Um, my new babies and my big baby is at home and my biggest baby is driving us home. Daddy of two more boys. Yes. Just made them even sexier. Yeah, they did. Yeah, it did. I didn't mm -hmm. think it was possible. You didn't think it was I possible? I didn't think it was possible. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, the baby's names. I, you all should probably already know this because I, I will have uh, probably tweeted it out already. Pay attention to the road. Um, the first of the two that was born was my itty bitty baby, my four pound, 13 ounce baby. And his name is Cy Wendell Anthony Tanksley. His name was originally, uh, well, we had planned on naming him Cy Nathaniel Anthony Tanksley, and Nathaniel was after uh, Marcus's dad. But due to um, changing circumstances, we definitely wanted to give a tribute out to their godfather, who was such a wonderful man, and they uh would have been so blessed to be able to have him in their life so we wanted to make him a permanent fixture and then um my big baby he is he was born seven pounds one ounce and fussy um <laughs> his name is kai jonathan anthony Tanksley. so those are my two new additions to my family you all will meet them soon my babies taking care of myself and my family all right oh if you're wondering why my lip looks like that is because I had to let the big one suck on my lip just to give my breast a chance to <laughs> heal because he was acting like such a glutton all right